Yeah, I think, I think probably doing a cortisone shot. Doing a cortisone shot to your face for acne seems like a great thing. Actually, there's a lot of actors who I know, guys, um, especially guys do this, I hear. Like, a lot of guys I, um, I'll work with, they'll say, if you have a pimple, I can't even remember. I, there's so many that I can't even remember. Like, I feel like they're like, oh, you don't get the cortisone shot? I'm like, how do you know about that? They're like, oh, yeah, whenever you get a little bit of a pimple, you go to the dermatologist and you get a cortisone shot, and it makes it um, go away. The only problem is, is that it can sometimes collapse your skin. So you can get like literally a divot in your skin. And if you're lucky, I was lucky because I did that and I got the divot in my skin and it filled back up. But if you're not lucky and you don't have enough collagen, hyaluronic acid and all those other great things that you need to fill up your skin, you'll just have a, a divot the rest of your life. So it's a very risky thing to do. But I've done cortisone, I did the toothpaste on it, I've done the acids. Like, you know, you know that thing where you feel like I have to like basically rip off my skin to start anew. I basically have tried all those, but definitely I think cortisone shots, leaving a, um, a, cater, uh, a crater in my, my face. For me, the number one thing I do when I feel a breakout coming, you can feel it, you know, everybody can feel it when it kind of, kind of comes underneath your skin, is I, I use this, just an on-the-spot treatment from Proactive. And I just think as soon as you put something on top of it, it starts to act way deep down beneath the surface to the point where that's where acne begins. I think my first tip is like, don't wait. If you start to feel it, put something on it immediately. And if you don't happen to have that with you, um, I think the best thing to do is um, a warm washcloth because it either will make the pimple go down or it will bring it up so then you can like try to take care of it. But don't pop. If you ever need to pop, you take like needle nose tweezers, those really, really super sharp ones, and then you just take the, the, the top of the pimple off and then you can like lightly like, um, it'll actually most stuff actually comes out with a tweezer.